Hello everybody and welcome to Assassin's Creed Syndicate episode 6 on Blade. We just Only killed the railway wasn't enough. Now Starek has bought an omnibus company as well. Fuck I you. suppose he wants to control the neighborhood's workers and keep them under his thumb. Pearl Attaway is Starek's competitor, is she? Perhaps it's time I went into business. And Miss Fry. What are your plans? I studied the history we recovered from the Kenway Mansion's hidden room. I'm off to a certain monument. Nice. Okay. This should be interesting now. Level 5. I don't even know. But we've got plenty of missions now. Oh my god, level 9. No, okay. Let's see. See you out on our next mission, guys. Bobby's ever gonna sort of. That might keep me nervous. You can't be frightened, Harry. Okay. Those lot feed so I decided us. not to kill that much with the territories because I'm wasting so much time so I decided just to film the what's actually happening you know like I go that I go kill the Templar or I just uh, bounty hunt the other guy you know so yeah let's try to kill this motherfucker Are you kidding me? Okay, now she's so gonna come here. And she's gonna die. And that's all. We're not doing the barrels thing because I don't know how to do it. Okay, come here. Oh, really? Okay. Hello. You can't go up there. You see, two minutes, and we're finished. Okay, see you at our next objective. Okay, now we're in a gang stronghold. And you're gonna die. Okay, two down, ten more to go. Cool. It's not a son of a bitch, it's a bitch because she's a woman. And yes, and yes, I uh, assume her gender. And again, guys, you know the story. See you at our next objective. Okay, and now here we will try liberation thing. Hello. Hello. By the way. What the fuck are you doing? Okay. Look sharp. Thanks, Maxley. 
that was it. Child liberation completed. Yeah, I know this part is a, is a bit boring. I know, I know. We're gonna get into the mission soon. I just need to make a better level, you know. So I'm, I'm uh, getting this district too. So yeah, uh, you know, ready to drill. Okay. Shut up. Look, my fellow rooks. To my side. I'm here if you need me. Ready to fight if you need me, Jacob. Why would I do? Territory secured. It's like San Andreas. Even the even the gang is green, <laughs> like in San Andreas. Okay, bounty hunt. I hate this. Let's see you there. We've got three territories to go, and then we're going to do our mission, guys. Don't worry. See you there. Bounty hunt. Here's a child something against strongholds, and then we're good to go with our missions. Let's see. At least I'm killing this motherfucker. I'm helping you out. Thank you, sir. Yes. Children aid society. Nice. Okay, we've got a bounty hunt, and I fucking hate them, but we're doing that and we're going to do that gang stronghold at the end, so see you there. Away with you! Oh. So that belongs to the blighters! Hello, what the fuck are you doing? You wanna die? Decided to pay me a visit. Come here.
Well, you're gonna die. Ooh, fuck you. Okay. <laughs> that was so lame. Okay. Well, we killed at least the leader of this bureau. A district or how the fuck do you call them? Bureaus, maybe? I'm, I'm not sure. But anyway, I hope she's dead. And we are teleported to the gang stronghold. So let's do that anyway. With no XP boost, pop off. And the last one, see you there. Let's clear a pathway. Get out of my fucking way! Let him run, let him run. Just a bit more. Uh, just a little bit. Don't you dare run in the other way. Fucking die, piece of shit. Come here. This is going to be face, easy if you go about like that, mate. And we've liberated this this district. Now there's a gang war. Okay. See you there. What the fuck is with the game? We've been challenged to a fight to settle the claim on this borough. Okay. Borough, not bureau. But I get it now. Borough. Miss Plum is no longer head of the Southwark Blighters, and they go into this fight leaderless. Rooks have good odds. Of course they have. They've got me.
nice. Okay. Now let's see. We're going to the missions. See you there. Okay, so we've seen what's what Jacob did. Let's see what's happening with Evie, shall we? Miss Fry, what a pleasant surprise. Hello, Clara. I was just going to check on Lambeth since the asylum's closing. What brings you here? The children in my care have been falling ill. A usual tonics aren't working. A cane, too. Are you certain you're feeling all right? Of course. I am, miss. Clara! Is there a doctor nearby? Bring her inside. She simply collapsed? Yes, she said the others took tonic, but it didn't work. I should think not. Ever since Elliotson was murdered, the district has been overrun with counterfeit tonics. <laughs> this one needs proper care. But without the appropriate medication, she and the others will quickly decline. What do you need? I need supplies. Plenty of them. And medicine. Some of the less common ingredients are being stolen and sold at auction. I'd be happy to help. Here's the list. This... Fry. Evie Fry. I'm Miss Nightingale. How do you do? Please hurry. We don't have much time. Not for poor Clara. She's ill. Okay, we need to move, apparently, faster. Let me fucking go. Okay. Let me fucking go. San Andreas Freestyle, come on, get out. Like CJ would said, can I have this? Where's my fucking carriage? Oh, here. Well, this is my head. Suburbs. Rooks OG coming to do damage. Get out of the way, please. Thank you. Thank you.
can't thank you enough. These supplies are meant for Miss Nightingale. I'm here to collect them. And they're already loaded on the cart. Please take them. Giddy up! Oh, you mean for that fuck's sake. Yes. Of course it is. Please be careful. Some of those items are fragile. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you kidding me? Not a moment too soon. I hope you brought the medication I requested. How is she? She will recover. Pablonelli, the children. Thanks to you, we can distribute authentic medicine now. But is that a permanent solution? I will petition to have regulations put in place. Lambeth is in your debt. It takes a long time to change things. But I'm not going anywhere, Miss Fry. Well, this was fun. See you at our next mission, guys. Okay, and we're back at Mr. Graham Bell. Breaking news! This fucking bell, man. Every time, every fucking mission. Ah! Oh! Jacob, Evie, it's you. Thank goodness. Experimenting, are we, Alec? Correct. And looking a bit frazzled. Nerves. It's those great oafs Starrett keeps sending around to coax me. He is offering a ridiculous amount of money. Alec, you're not thinking of jumping ship, are you? Never. I've been working in something in case they get too insistent. Uh, it's meant to stun an assailant, should they need a rise. Are you certain that it works? Uh, not as such. I've made three of them with varying degrees of acidity and whatnot. Oh, one must be the right formula. Let's find some Staric lackeys to target then, shall we? <laughs> Speaking of Staric, he is still transmitting false information. We could simply destroy his transmitters. His company's too well guarded. And the bombs will help, but it would be awkward to produce bombs that potentially do not stun. Oh, wait a minute. Looks like opportunity has come knocking. Oh dear, they never looked so angry before. Stand clear, Alec. Let us instead play a little linguistic game with them. Um, take the bombs and climb onto the roof. Uh, when I see the name of uh, a fruit, toss one near the thugs. Right then. Oh, uh, oh wait, uh, I nearly forgot. Um, slip these into your boots and you will henceforth be immune to all voltaic discharge. I think. Not a kid. <laughs> okay, let's see. Look at all these chests. Give me chest. Gentlemen, oh, I would ask you. Enough of the nice 
Tease. We've come to smash your place up, ain't we, Bess? You got one of them telly what's it's in here, ain't ya? You? You've been reading messages from the Steric Company. That is as untrue as the notion that the Steric Telegraph Company is emitting impartial information, sir. Come again? Your employer's promises are nothing but hot air. His operations are about to turn pear shaped. Oh, really? I took the. You had the mental agility of a dollop of donkey's apples. Apples? I think he's trying to be funny. Oh, you dropped another one, Bill. You little sod. Well, ain't me, Bez. <laughs> God blind me, it's got me throat. Oh, oh, those rascals throwing stink bombs again. It happens all the time around here. Where you keep that telly, what's it? I'll count to three. Three? Well, well, let's see how far you get. One. Do you really think I would keep it here? Do you see a cable? Do you really think I would keep it here? Do you see a cable? A telegraph without a cable is about as useful as a bell without a clapper. I'll give you a bleeding clapper. Well, bless my boots, you're as purple as a plum. A plum? I feel all wobbly, Baz. Looks like it's harder to be. Good show, Alec. Thanks to you, Evie. Your mere presence gave me courage and resolve I never knew I had. I'm glad I could help. Now it's time to shut down Stark's empire of propaganda. Come on, we haven't got the longer we can keep static from spewing out false information, the more we can awaken the people to the truth. Operations. I agree. The sooner we can get there, the quicker we can act. Would you believe my mother says there are still some wives in her street that swear by that shooting cell? So I took it upon myself to tell her neighbors the truth about the obnoxious draft. That's good, Alec. But you can't go round to every household in London town. No, it wasn't always welcome. It shows how false information can be as difficult to stamp out as fishwives' profanities and villains gave. More vermin at Smithfield. But if we can eradicate the source that continually feeds such detrimental trash, then little by little the truth will take the upper hand and the sham will be flushed out. That's why we're here. But we have to get in without being detected, mine. I shall stand them while you get inside. I shall destroy not one, but three parts of the transmitter. He'll be as good as dancing before a public toilet without a penny. Beautiful. 
fool is she? That it's been soiled by corrupt amends. Die, bitch. if you can. Jacob Eve, thanks are once again in order for supporting what is most dear to me and to our cause, freedom of speech. It's a blessing that you employ your genius for the common good, Alec. However, I suggest you vacate your workshop. No need. Not now you've given me sacks full of courage. And besides, what with my little devices, I have all the protection I need. Uh, should you find yourselves with a moment to spare, do a drop by. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, this was fun. Electrocuting, electrocuting. I don't know how to pronounce that. Electrocuting tugs. Well, defend the civilian. Well. I think this is it for this episode guys, like and subscribe to my content coming very very soon on Blade and I'm out.